Title, Shattered Reflections. The small forgotten town of Ravenswood had always been cloaked in an eerie silence, a silence that seemed to stretch beyond the boundaries of time itself. It was a place where shadows danced with malevolent glee, and the moon's pale light cast an otherworldly glow upon the decaying buildings and overgrown streets. In the heart of this desolate town stood the abandoned mansion, a crumbling relic of a forgotten era. For years, locals whispered tales of unspeakable horror that had befallen the mansion's previous occupants. Dark rumors spread like wildfire, and the mere mention of the mansion's name sent shivers down the spines of those brave enough to listen. But, as with any cursed place, curiosity inevitably led a group of young adventurers to its rotting doorstep. The group consisted of five friends, Emily, the cautious skeptic, Jason, the thrill-seeker, Mia, the empathic soul, David, the tech-savvy skeptic, and Sarah, the spiritual believer. Armed with flashlights and trembling nerves, they entered the mansion on a moonless night the air thick with a sense of impending doom. The mansion's interior was a labyrinth of dusty corridors, creaking floors, and walls adorned with faded portraits of long-forgotten faces. The flickering candlelight they carried cast eerie shadows that seemed to sway in rhythm with their racing hearts. Each step echoed ominously, as if the very house was trying to warn them of the horrors it held. As they ventured deeper, they discovered a locked room at the end of a narrow hallway. David's curiosity got the better of him, and he produced a set of lock-picking tools. With a triumphant click, the door swung open to reveal a room frozen in time. A grand mirror dominated the room, its ornate frame reflecting a twisted version of reality. Mia's empathic senses went into overdrive as she approached the mirror. She saw flashes of torment and despair, the pain of souls trapped in a sinister web. Sarah, sensing a malevolent presence, began to chant ancient incantations in an attempt to banish the evil that had lingered for centuries. But her efforts only seemed to exacerbate the darkness. Jason, ever the skeptic, approached the mirror and chuckled nervously. He reached out to touch the glass, and in an instant, his reflection leapt out, grabbing his wrist with bony, pale fingers. Emily screamed as the mirror's surface rippled, and the room transformed into a grotesque mockery of their reality. Time and space twisted, and the group found themselves trapped within the mirror's realm. Reality fragmented into nightmarish visions, where their deepest fears and regrets taunted them relentlessly. The mansion's walls seemed to breathe, closing in on them, as malevolent whispers clawed at their minds. One by one the friends were consumed by their own horrors. Jason was lost to a never-ending spiral of darkness, his laughter turned to anguished screams. Mia was tormented by the cries of the forgotten souls, her empathy transformed into a curse. David's technological prowess became a prison as he was trapped in a labyrinth of endless circuits. Sarah's spiritual beliefs shattered, and she was haunted by vengeful spirits from beyond. Only Emily remained, her skepticism her only shield against the horrors that surrounded her. She knew she had to confront the mirror's malevolent force to free her friends. With a steely resolve, she faced the mirror's twisted reflection of herself, her own eyes cold and unyielding. You won't break me, she whispered, her voice barely audible over the cacophony of despair. The mirror's surface trembled, and the mansion began to shake violently. Emily's determination shattered the mirror's grip on reality, and the friends were thrust back into the decaying mansion, free from the mirror's grasp. As dawn broke, the mansion crumbled to dust, its malevolent force finally vanquished. The friends emerged, scarred and forever changed, but alive. They knew they had stared into the abyss and emerged stronger, united by a shared experience that defied explanation. Ravenswood remained a haunted memory, a testament to the darkness that could lurk within even the most ordinary of places, and as the years passed, the legend of the shattered reflections lived on, a cautionary tale for those who dared to tread the thin line between reality and nightmare.